Hello and welcome to my video, how to apply metallic gold and silver metallic powder makeup with mixing liquid to your skin. Mayron's metallic powder is an ultra-fine, loose powder pigment that is made for creating dramatic, high-shine metallic designs. Use the loose powder on its own to create soft metallic accents or mix with mixing liquid to transform metallic powder into a long wear, transfer resistant liquid metal paint. You can apply the dry metallic powder to your skin with a dry brush by dipping the dry brush applicator into the metallic powder and painting over the skin with a brush applicator, sponge, or your finger. Use the loose powder on its own to create soft metallic accents or mix with mixing liquid to transform metallic powder into a long wear, transfer resistant liquid metal paint. By adding mixing liquid, metallic powder turns into an intense molting liquid makeup that can be painted onto the body or face and used to create designs like metallic eyeliner and metallic lips. You can intensify the metallic powder look by mixing the metallic powder with a mixing liquid, which is a mineral oil. By adding mixing liquid, metallic powder turns into an intense molting liquid makeup. You can intensify the metallic powder look by mixing the metallic powder with a mixing liquid, which is a mineral oil. Place a small amount of metallic powder pigment in a small tray, then pour a very small amount of mineral oil or Mayron mineral oil mixing liquid in the tray and mix the pigment powder together. For my first demonstration, I'm going to apply the silver and the gold powder to my skin dry. So this powder is still dry here. So I'm going to use a brush to show you how the gold powder goes on my skin. I'm going to dip it into the dry powder. And I'm going to go up here. I'm going to shut my eye because the powder is falling. If you can see that. I 
I'm going to do the same thing with the silver dry powder. This is dry. I'm going to dip the brush in here. Close my eyes because the powder tends to fall. Add some gold powder to my upper lip. It's dry. And then some silver powder to my lower lip. Now I'm going to apply the wet powder with the mineral oil mixed in it. Now I'm going to take the gold powder and add the mixing liquid to it, just some drops there, which is a mineral oil. Then I'm going to take my brush and I'm going to stir it up until it's completely liquid form. So here is the dry powder and then this is the comparison to the wet powder. Now I'm going to apply the wet powder to my lip, which already has the gold powder on it. This one's going to be wet, so you can see the difference. Wet silver over top of the dry powder. Apply the liquid metallic pigment to your skin with a brush applicator, sponge, or airbrush. The liquid metallic pigment will dry completely with a vibrant liquid metal paint finish on your skin. Allow five minutes to completely dry and the metallic liquid makeup washes off very easily with soap and water.
To clean my brushes, I used Ultra Dawn dishwashing liquid, which was easy to clean off all the silver and gold powder. And you can see how clean the bowls came using the Ultra Dawn dishwashing liquid. The metallic powder has been dry for about 15 minutes, so I'm going to do a smear test on the silver and the gold. So it's dry. You can see it does not smear. So there's a little bit of sheen on my fingers, but if I spray a setting spray, this would completely dry on my face and stay on my face. So now I'm going to take a dry paper towel and do a smear test. Now I'm going to take a wet paper towel and wet it and then wipe over my face to see how it comes off with just water. Okay, that's just the water. Now I'm going to use some soap and a wet paper towel to show you how easily it is to remove the metallic powder from my skin. Try this one. Now I'm going to wipe it off. Okay, so it comes off much better with soap. So in conclusion, when cleaning up your brushes and your space and your bowls, just use some Dawn dishwashing liquid and use soap and water to remove it off your skin. I do hope you enjoyed this video. Please check out my other video transformations and face painting tutorials on this channel. I do hope you click subscribe and the bell icon to receive a notification of my future videos. As always, thanks for watching.